Kostrena is a small community near the town of Rijeka, but also the rich one. As you can see behind me, there is a kindergarten and there is also an elementary school. And families who live here also enjoy benefits of this community because community co-finances transportation and scholarship for students and their school books. And Kostrena also has a beautiful promenade and it's beloved, beloved destination for many citizens of the town of Rijeka, especially when the weather is nice. Today we have a bit of rain, but that's all okay. But in the summer it's here very crowded because Kostrena has also many beautiful beaches. I'm going to show you some of them. Almost every single family from Kostrena had or still has at least one member of its family who was or still is a sea captain or chief engineer or sailor. And that's the reason that recently here was opened a maritime museum. Let's check it out. So the museum has three levels, I'm on the first level and here you can see it's a huge anchor. And here is the Bay of Gladner, you can see here is the town of Rijeka and near is Kostrena, a small community. Small, very beautiful. And this is the island of Rab and these are the islands of Tres and Loshin and the island of Krk. My son has something to write on. <laughs> something about the professor he had in high school. Well, and these are international signs. So we are on the second level. And you can see here of different kind of ships. And here you can see some old objects that people from Kostrena donated to this maritime museum. You can take a challenge here and answer us for some questions. Correct? Bravo Nino! Yeah, 
he knows everything. I have a smart kid. And I'm here on the third floor. As you can see, there are some knots, ropes. <laughs> and the uh, bell. It's very, very interesting. And there are old, old maps. Compass. And old ship logs. Well, we who are living near the sea, we have a special connection with it. And we respect the sea because we know how dangerous it could be when you are on it. And there is also a tour guide here in Maritime Museum who can uh, show you and tell you a story about everything. Well, anyway, it's worth to see it. And there is also possibility for we are traveling. Let's go, Nino. Wait a second. Ah, okay. Waiting for my sea captain. I don't like this real bullshit. Oh, okay, nice. Okay, and let's go. Easy, easy. I don't want to catch uh, seasickness. Uh huh. Ah, there is a night. We're traveling that <laughs> night. Oh, nice. Who knows what he sees now? I knew the dirty slab. Why are you yelling? <laughs> uh huh. There is a moon in front of us. Can you see it? And there are some the stars. Oh, it's going to be a long oh, journey. Oh, wow. What is in front of us? A land? A rock? What? An island? No, we're following the star. Ah, we're following the star. Huh? No, I don't see it. Let's go for the... <laughs> Money method. A little... Oh, oh you can go. certainly have some fun here. And it's a day. Engine, engine room, that's low, that's low. <laughs> Captain... Captain speaking, uh, Chief Engineer, can you hear me? That's low, that's low. Chief number one, please put two sailors on top. Well, my son was on the ship as a cadet engineer, so he knows a bit. Prepare for a lot of drinkings, guys. <laughs> 